Staying Strong, Healthy, and Youthful. By subscribing, liking, and ringing, you can greatly support our channel and help us produce more content that you'll love. Hello and welcome to the Longevity Lifestyle YouTube channel. Stomatitis is a medical condition that causes inflammation and soreness of the mouth's lining. The condition can cause pain, discomfort, and difficulty in eating, speaking, or swallowing. Stomatitis can affect people of all ages, from infants to adults, and can range from mild to severe. In this video, we'll be talking about the causes, symptoms, and treatment options for stomatitis. Causes of stomatitis. Viral infections. Viral infections, such as the herpes simplex virus, can cause stomatitis. Herpes stomatitis, also known as cold sores, is a common viral infection that causes painful blisters around the mouth and lips. Bacterial infections. Bacterial infections, such as streptococcal infections, can also cause stomatitis. These infections can lead to the formation of small, painful sores in the mouth. Fungal infections. Fungal infections, such as oral thrush, can cause stomatitis. Oral thrush is a common fungal infection that can cause white patches on the tongue, mouth, and throat. Irritation. Irritation of the mouth lining can also cause stomatitis. Irritants such as tobacco, alcohol, and spicy foods can irritate the mouth lining, leading to inflammation and soreness. Allergic reactions. Allergic reactions to certain foods, medications, or dental materials can cause stomatitis. These allergic reactions can lead to the formation of blisters or ulcers in the mouth. Immune system disorders. Immune system disorders, such as lupus or HIV, can cause stomatitis. These disorders weaken the immune system, making it easier for infections to develop. Symptoms of stomatitis. Pain or discomfort in the mouth. Swollen, red, or bleeding gums. Small, painful sores or ulcers in the mouth. Blisters or cold sores on the lips or around the mouth. White patches on the tongue, mouth, or throat. Difficulty eating, speaking, or swallowing. Fever or headache in severe cases. Treatment for stomatitis. It depends on the underlying cause of the condition. Medications. Antiviral medications can be used to treat viral infections, such as herpes stomatitis. Antibiotics can be used to treat bacterial infections, while antifungal medications can be used to treat fungal infections. Mouthwashes. Mouthwashes containing antiseptic or anti-inflammatory agents can be used to relieve pain and discomfort associated with stomatitis. Pain relief. Over-the-counter pain relief medications, such as acetaminophen or ibuprofen, can be used to relieve pain and discomfort associated with stomatitis. Avoiding irritants. Avoiding irritants such as tobacco, alcohol, and spicy foods can help reduce inflammation and soreness of the mouth lining. Immune system support. Supporting the immune system through a healthy diet and lifestyle can help prevent stomatitis caused by immune system disorders. Prevention of stomatitis. Practicing good oral hygiene by brushing and flossing regularly. Avoiding sharing utensils or other personal items with someone who has stomatitis. Avoiding contact with individuals who have viral infections such as cold sores. Avoiding irritants such as tobacco, alcohol, and spicy foods. Seeking medical attention for any underlying health conditions that may weaken the immune. Types of stomatitis. There are several types of stomatitis, each with its own unique characteristics and causes. Herpetic stomatitis. Herpetic stomatitis is a viral infection caused by the herpes simplex virus. The condition causes painful blisters around the mouth and lips, which can be spread through contact with the sores. Aphthous stomatitis. Aphthous stomatitis is a common type of stomatitis that causes small, painful ulcers in the mouth. The cause of aphthous stomatitis is not well understood, but it is thought to be related to immune system function. Traumatic stomatitis. Traumatic stomatitis is caused by physical damage to the mouth lining, such as from biting the tongue or cheek. The condition can cause painful sores or ulcers in the mouth. Allergic stomatitis. Allergic stomatitis is caused by an allergic reaction to certain foods, medications, or dental materials. The condition can cause redness, swelling, and blistering in the mouth. When to seek medical attention. In most cases, stomatitis can be easily treated at home. However, if symptoms persist or worsen, it may be necessary to seek medical attention. You should seek medical attention if you experience any of the following symptoms. Severe pain or discomfort in the mouth. 
sores or ulcers that do not heal after a week or more, white patches in the mouth that do not go away, difficulty swallowing or breathing, high fever or headache. Conclusion. Stomatitis is a common medical condition that can cause pain, discomfort, and difficulty in eating, speaking, or swallowing. The condition can be caused by viral, bacterial, or fungal infections, as well as irritants, allergic reactions, and immune system disorders. Treatment for stomatitis depends on the underlying cause of the condition and may include medications, mouthwashes, pain relief, avoiding irritants, and supporting the immune system. Preventing stomatitis involves practicing good oral hygiene, avoiding contact with individuals who have viral infections, and seeking medical attention for underlying health conditions. While most cases of stomatitis can be easily treated, it is important to seek medical attention if symptoms persist or worsen. Thank you for watching and we hope this video has been informative and helpful. I recommend that you watch all the videos I upload from the beginning to gain a comprehensive understanding of the topics covered. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more videos on health and wellness. See you in the next one.